everybody, Brock Peterson here, VMware Solutions Engineer. Today we're going to talk a little bit about the vRealize True Visibility Suite, specifically the Cisco UCS Management Pack. Let's so log into vRealize Operations, go to Administration, click Repository. At this point you'll see all of the native management packs at the top. Down below you'll see all of the third-party management packs, including those from vrTBS. To install one, click Add Upgrade, select Browse, and point it at the pack file that you wish to install, generally 30, 40 meg pack files. Select OK, Upload. This will prepare it for installation on your VROPS cluster. Once done, you will be presented with the option to choose other accounts when you make your adapter instance. So let's go ahead and do that. Click Add Account. Select the Cisco UCS tile. Give it a friendly name. In this case, I'm going to name it Cisco UCS because I'm connecting to our Cisco UCS manager. Give it the host name upon which manager sits, the protocol you intend to use, add a credential. In this case, we support both local authentication as well as AD or LDAP. Click Validate Connection. It'll go out to Cisco UCS manager, perform the authentication, and come back. At this point, we have UCS Manager data coming into vRealize Operations. So how do we use it? Let's go to Dashboard to explore some of those. Click Dashboards. Select Cisco UCS, and you'll see five dashboards. Cisco UCS Overview is a good place to start. So the overview will give us several different interesting topics. It'll give us all of our objects, chassis, blades, fabric, interconnects, racks, all the way down to fans. It'll also give us various metrics per object. So for example, you want to look at Ethernet or fiber being sent through a particular fabric interconnect. You can select a different configuration. This allows you visibility into Cisco UCS from vRealize Operations at a high level. Now, let's explore the troubleshooting workbench enriched by vrTBS. So the troubleshooting workbench was introduced in vRealize Operations 8.0. It's a beautiful new feature that allows you to troubleshoot items from point to point. So let's go ahead and select a VM that is running on UCS in this case. I'll show all of the objects on the left hand side and things like events, property changes, and anomalous metrics on the right. If I want to scope, meaning move out to parents, grandparents, great great grandparents, etc., I simply adjust the scope top left. I select the custom button, it'll take us to the advanced object relationship showing me all of these relationships. So here's my VM. Now we have the visibility into Cisco UCS from that VM. So here is an upstream fabric interconnect. Here's another fabric interconnect. Here's the host that VM sits on. More importantly, here's the UCS blade that host is on. Here's the chassis that blade is in. So you can see that we get visibility beyond the vSphere edge from the vRealize Operations platform. Much, much more can be done with the Cisco UCS Management Pack. I encourage you to download it and install it in your environment.